Hi, in this video we're going to show you a free tool you could use to edit your right-click send to menu items in Windows. So that way when you right-click on a file you could take action on it instead of having to go about it the long way. So there are other ways to do this, you know, via the registry and going to the send to folder and so on. But this way is actually pretty simple. So you just download the zip file and extract it. There's nothing to install. Then just run the executable. Most likely the 64-bit, unless you're somehow still running a 32-bit version of Windows. Okay, so this will show you what you currently have. So if I right-click, of course, with Windows 11, you have to go show more options. Unless, of course, you right-click and hold down Shift at the same time. And then we have the Send To options here. So, of course, you could remove them using this app as well. And here's Refresh. Open the Send To folder, which will open the folder where these items are located. And then some information. Okay, so we're going to add. So you could do a file or folder. So first, let's do a folder. And let's say we want to have a Send To Pictures folder. So you got to find pictures. There it is. You can change the name. You could add a parameter. So, of course, the working directory has to be under your user profile for it to work. And then you could change the icon as well. It should pick the default icon for it. So I'll click on Create Shortcut. So now, let's go to the Pictures folder here. Okay, so now we're going to right-click on this image file. Send to. And now I can choose Pictures, so watch the Pictures folder on the right there. So you can see it shows up in there. Okay, so that's doing it with a folder. So now let's do another one for a program here. So we'll click on the target file. And we're going to add Notepad for our test. Okay, so create shortcut. So obviously if you had a text file, you would just double click it to open with Notepad. But this could come in handy for other files that do not open with Notepad by default or whatever other program you're using. So we have this registry file, for example. So if we were to double click it, it would want to import it into the registry. So if we wanted to view it, we could right click on it. Let's hold down shift this time. Send to Notepad. Then it opens it with Notepad. Then you could do that with CSV files or any other type of log file that you might open with Notepad. And like I said, if you want it removed, just highlight it, click on remove, and then it's gone. All right, so it's a pretty basic tool, but it's pretty effective at the same time. So I will put a link in the description where you can download Send to Menu Editor and you can try it for yourself. All right, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.